show this year is going to be possibly the best in 25 years. I have been to all of them. There's not one that I've missed. And the one coming up, uh, public days are this Friday through to Sunday. If you've never been to one, you have to at least contemplate going to this one. There is something for everybody. It is an embarrassment of riches in terms of military aircraft, civil aircraft. It's got everything. It's, it's going to be absolutely incredible. We saw the, um, the RWF's new airlifter, the C-27. We saw a fly, pi- a fly pass by uh, two classic Hornets. Um, we saw a Spitfire. Um, uh, is the, RW, is the RAAF still flying Spitfires, is it? Uh, they are, yes. Um, well, no, it's a warbird. But it was, you know, it was state-of-the-art 1943 when we were flying them. We flew 700 of them, if you can believe that, Tom. And they just threw them away at the end of the war. It's all very sad. You could buy one for £5. Pounds. But anyway, yeah. they, they are back in the skies. There was a boomerang as well. And you know the history of the boomerang, Tom, I'm sure. Mm. Um, tell, tell well, it was, was a training it? aircraft, wasn't it? Well, no, it, it started off as a, a two-seat training aircraft and then the Japanese threatened invasion and our government thought, what can we do? So um, it was a different time back then. The government could make a decision quickly and within two months or three months turn around a fighter aircraft and that's what they did. OK, now, there was a rumour that the Joint Strike Fighter was going to put in an appearance. Did you see one of those? No, it wasn't out there, but um, I have it on very good authority that they will be there. There will be two of them, I believe. So if you want to come down and see where $16 billion of your uh, tax money is going, it's a good place to start.